I was a victim of fraud. $10 million in my name. With a cheque that had no knowledge, no knowledge of. of. And her name was even spelled incorrectly on the, on the cheque. The check. And <laughs> I'm a victim, victim of, of crime. crime. How can they do that? Because they did the wrong thing and you're the one that's paid the cost. I paid the price, but they hid it. And I said I've never been to the bank and I, in fact, even have a letter of them calling me a liar. And I said, well, then provide me with the CCTV. But they just kept brushing us aside. The lawyer I had basically said, you're never going to beat a bank. You have to pay this debt. And I said, but I don't have that money. I didn't create this debt. But even the legal system worked against me until I was completely drained. So I tried to take my own life. It's an instituted system of deny, lie, bleed them dry and hope they die. So this has been going on for 12 years now. If there hadn't been a spotlight thrown on this Recently, I don't know what would become of it. It needs substantial change. Authorised by Claire O'Neill, ALP Clayton.